Hi, my name is Eric Sillard. I am the writer-director of Diaconia. And uh, we decided to do a podcast. Um, we're trying to cover all the social media so we can get everybody engaged around Lebanon and get them involved in what we're doing and, and this project that we have going. I want to be able to share everything from the ground up, the nuts and bolts of the project. And to do that, we're doing a podcast as well. So every couple days, I'm going to be posting a short podcast, a couple minutes long, to say where we're at with the project, what we have going on, you know, what's happening directly in front of us, just to let everybody know, for those people like myself, who I tend to listen to a lot of podcasts because they're quick, I mean, I can do other things and kind of have it playing in my ear, and I don't generally have time to sit down and just look through social media or, you know, play something on social media. So we decided for all of you podcast people out there, such as myself, this would probably be the best way to go. So we right now are in the early stages. We are going to be putting together Diaconia. And this being the first podcast, I should let you know Diaconia is intended to be a streaming series that's hopefully going to be shot in Lebanon, Pennsylvania. We're going to be shooting the trailer for it in Lebanon, Pennsylvania over the fall. We are super excited to be shooting at the Lutheran Church in off 7th Street and Lehman. And I can tell you exactly what that is in just a second. And that church is gorgeous. It's just one of those amazing locations that you just, well, as soon as I walked into it, I was just like, wow, you know, this is something we have to feature. And the church itself is basically a landmark of Lebanon. And that's what we really want to do. We want to shoot in places in Lebanon that are landmarks. So it's actually the Holy Trinity Lutheran Church. And it's on at 723 Lehman Street. If you haven't seen it, it is next to Monument Park. It is a giant, just gorgeous church. Um, and we were super happy and just super humbled that Pastor Gretchen well, met with us and, and heard about what we were doing and that they're letting us do this. So we are going to be shooting at the church. It's going to be our first shoot. It's going to be on September 10th. And we are just super excited to have that location. So the trailer is going to be shot in multiple stages because a lot of times with independent projects, because we are an independent project, we are not funded already by anybody. We are going to be basically making this project so that we can then take it to distributors such as a Netflix, a Hulu, a Roku, um, all these distributors out there. We're going to be tagging the crap out of them once we actually shoot something. Um, we've been building our social media so when people start getting tagged, they're not just like, oh, this is the first thing they've done. Um, so that's a big important step to this as well. It's really a building process. So we're building it right now with social media pictures and I've put up a, a script, I believe, or at least pages from it. I put up some storyboards. I'm going to put up everything front to back on this project so everybody can feel like you're involved. So what you do is in our position is you're going to shoot this trailer and we want it to make it as amazing as possible because then you use that trailer to sell the idea to a distributor. So right now, I mean, I'm sitting on a treatment for 12 episodes of a streaming series and I'm sitting on the first script is done. We have a treatment. All these things are pieces to getting something like this off the ground. It's basically the business plan to a film series. So we have all this going and our, our thought was let's pick great places in Lebanon. And we're super excited to have the church. We're also excited that the Lebanon Valley Mall is going to be allowing us to have auditions there on August 27th. So if you know anyone that's an actor, if you want to be an actor, if you have experience or you know someone with experience from 12 to 4 on August 27th in the old Payless spot, we're going to be having auditions. We're also going to be doing interviews with people who are interested of just chatting to them like, you know, why are they there? Did how they hear about the project? And that stuff we're going to put on social media as well. And then we're also going to have filmed auditions in the back and sides will be there for talent so when you get there we can kind of have someone there to say you'll fit this you'll fit that and then they're gonna end up giving you your sides and then you can look them over and then you'll come back and give them a read so again you might get picked for an interview if you're interested um, we're hoping to have a great turnout so we really hope you tell your friends we hope you let everyone know that on august 27th we're going to be having the auditions for diaconia at the lebanon valley mall 
And I'm really excited. I'm really hopeful we get a lot of a big turnout. I hope people start sharing this. Our hope is that this turns into more of a Lebanon event, that this is something people get behind. And the trailer, as I first mentioned, when we're shooting it, we're shooting it in pieces because a lot of mistakes that are made in these low budget things that which were considered low budget because, I mean, everything's considered low budget compared to a Hollywood standard. Um and we don't have any backers ahead of time. So in situations like this, it's really important you get it right. And a lot of times what people do is they try to shoot the whole trailer in a very short period of time. So they'll try to shoot everything in one day. They'll try to shoot everything in, you know, like two days. We're going to shoot all this stuff. We're going to have eight locations. It's going to be amazing. And the truth of the matter is when you're filming, time is just one of the biggest things. Like it, you need time to light properly. You need time for the talent to be able to work with them and get what you need out of them we're gonna have a lot of movement in this trailer we're gonna have jib shots we're gonna have uh, we just picked up a doorway dolly that we're super excited to use in the aisle of the church you know we're gonna have all these great shots and you can't get all those when you're you know doing six pages a day it just doesn't happen hollywood does like I think one to two a day on a film, two to three if they're flying. You know, uh, independent film usually does five to six pages a day due to budget. Like, so by pages a day, it means how much you're covering in your script per day. So, you know, it's, it's challenging. And what we decided was instead of trying to jam everything in, we're going to take it one scene at a time. We're going to then start putting the pieces of that out there, rough cuts of it, behind the scenes of it. Um, interviews with the talent from the set. We're going to have all sorts of things we can keep sharing with you so that you can hopefully be engaged and hopefully feel like you're going along for the ride with us. And then we're going to move on to the next piece, the next location. So I'm really excited and it's really weird doing this podcast thing because I've never done it before and we'll see how it goes. But I just, like I said, I, I was vacuuming, listening to my favorite podcast the other day and I thought, Maybe this is a way we can keep everyone up to date. So keep an eye on the podcast, save it, please like it, give a comment, give a star, uh, tell people it doesn't suck, and hopefully more people pick up on it and you know keep in touch with everything we're doing. So find us on Twitter, social media of all kinds, you know, Facebook, we're on uh, Locals, which is a newer social media. We're also doing the Instagram thing. So, and people keep saying TikTok, so that might happen too, but it's all under Diaconia Film. So if you look Diaconia Film up, you should find us. All right, thank you so much for listening and have a great day. Bye. Nothing good happens when the lights go out.